Hello, my friends, and welcome to another Tuesday of Tutorial. I am Leonardo Perez Nieto, and today we will draw an angel. We start by measuring the height and width of the figure. I will also measure and mark the size of the head. In this way, we make sure our drawing will have the right proportions. I'm using a photo as a reference. Now we draw freely, trying to use loose movements all the way from your shoulder. The leg goes more or less like this. And I will measure the size of the feet. Good. I think the knee should be higher, yes. The more measurements you have, the easier it becomes. Now let's draw the face. The eyes go about at half the height of the head. For the sketch, I'm using a mechanical pencil, although for the shading, I'll use a sepia pencil. In this case, the sepia is a dark brown dry pasta. The full list of materials is in the information below the video. As you saw, I measured the size of the hand as well. The reason I'm using the mechanical pencil and not the sepia pencil for the sketch is because it's more precise and cleaner. Okay, at this point, let's erase all the lines that we don't need anymore. And I need to correct the other legs slightly. Good. Okay, great. Now let's shade with the sepia. You may find all these materials practically in any art supply store. And now with a chamois, which is a leather, I smudge it. I want the light coming from the left, so the right will be darker. And now that the chamois is dirty, so to speak, I can use it to give a tone to the figure. Nice, I like this effect. With the kneaded eraser, we pull some lights. Now with a stump, which is pretty impregnated with the sepia as well, we can shade further. Or we may draw with the sepia, and then smudge. Nice! I like so much doing this! Follow me on Facebook by clicking on the logo. It will open on a different window so you don't lose anything of the tutorial. You can do the hair in the same manner, shading with the pencil, smudging with the stump, and pulling lights with the eraser. I want to thank my beautiful model, Xenia Gurieva, for the inspiration. She is an angel. It is good to always learn to use new materials and techniques, and that you enjoy your drawing, and with that enhance your life and that of those around you. After you smudged it with a stump, if you wanted it even more even, you can go over it with a chamois. I'm very sorry, I missed a shot where I drew some lines on the clothing and smudging with a stump. Now let's darken the ground. In the comments, please let me know whether you like this technique or not. Now the feathers. Feathers, of course, are very soft, especially the ones of the angels. We can give a light tone and then smudge.
cool. At this point, we refine some lines and reinforce some shadows here and there. Also to the face and to the hair, and it's ready. If you enjoyed it, please give it a like, share it to your friends, and subscribe to this channel. And I will see you on Tuesday.